history has been made. In the showcase of the mortals, the Super Bowl of Wrestling, with all the drama, with all the spectacle, with all the pageantry that is WrestleMania in the city of brotherly love. In two nights of cold weather, WWE stands out by showing up for history-making greatest night ever, WrestleMania. It is time for night two of the WrestleMania recap. And I got to say, I love doing these intros when we do wrestling. <laughs> but I got to say, I, I, I apologize for not doing a podcast lately. This is the first time back doing podcasts in a long time. I have been sick off and on. Uh, I've been having suffering from panic attacks. And it's just, it's just been crazy. But And I, I'm so sorry for missing the Elimination Chamber, but it, it's okay because most of the people who won the Elimination Chamber was on this uh, spectacular show, this spectacular card. And uh, I'm here with, with, with a friend of mine and a high officer, uh, by, by the way. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Prince DJ. And I am the advocate of the one who is holding law and order to make the country. I am here to present the one, the only, the one that's going to be the sheriff of Big D country until the day I pass on. Ladies and gentlemen, the <laughs> sheriff, Big C. Hello, everyone. Welcome to second night two of the WrestleMania 40. <laughs> Recap. Okay. Drew McIntyre defeated Seth freaking Rollins. Singles match for the World Heavyweight Championship in a stunning fashion. I got that. Wrong. You know how it's going for, right? Seth Rollins. Oh, 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 oh. No. Oh no! I got oh man. You too. Oh. Yikes! But those spectacular entrances! Oh my gosh! Oh, only in WrestleMania would you see something like that. Only in WrestleMania. But um, after that, um, Damian Priest cashed in. Yeah, I heard that. They, uh, and it was At- all because of. It's all because of C M. Punk. At a time, at a set, at a at a record tying nine seconds. Holy cow! You know who else won? Nine seconds. Yes. Yeah. You know who also won a match at nine seconds at WrestleMania? Dang. WrestleMania won. At WrestleMania 1, King Kong Bundy defeated S.D. Jones in nine seconds. Oh, my God. Wow. That was history in the making. Yep. Second person to ever do that in WrestleMania history. (laughs) Wow. Anyway, excuse me. But, uh, yeah, like I said, I've been suffering through panic attacks and everything. But, anyway... Uh, but I love acting because it's a uh, it gave me a chance to escape uh, this crazy world. But anyway, continue. Um, the Pride, Bobby Lashley, Angelo Dawkins, and Montez Ford defeated the Final Testament, Karrion Cross, Akim, and Razor with Scarlett and Paul and and wrestling legendary manager Paul Ethering by pinfall. And guess who the guess who the um. Guess who the man? Guess who the special guest referee was in a Philadelphia street fight? Uh oh. <coughs> mm. Who was it? Bubba Ray Dudley. <gasps> Demon! Get the table! Oh my gosh! A nostalgia factor, brother. Wow. 
This is that was amazing. I bet you, I bet you, uh, I bet you the roof was blown off. A lot of people were changing wow. CW. Oh yeah, that's right. Well, there wasn't no roof at that place. Never, never mind, never mind. And I got, I got that wrong. I was going for the the long shot. I got, I got that wrong. Long shot. <laughs> you're right. You're okay. All right, you're all good. You're good. L.A. Knight defeated AJ Styles by pinfall. Yes, yes, yes. I was hope I was hoping so I could say L.A. Knight. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Uh oh. Uh oh. What happened? Logan Paul with I Show Speed defeated Kevin Owens and Randy <laughs> Orton by pinfall for the United States Championship. Logan Paul is still the champ. Long shot again. Long shot. Thank you. Uh. You, know what, you, know what, you know what? Prime Energy. You know what Prime. You know what Prime is really. Some of the what? flavors are coconut that? water. Coconut water. Oh, and you know I got I just had some pop uh, coconut popsicles too. Oh your, wow! But prime, your prime, but prime, but prime drink is um, actually not suitable for kids or teens. Exactly. I mean, Only for the adults, y'all. Only for the adults. Exactly. Anyway, but yeah, I had I had that one wrong because I want to. I want to, especially I want to KO to win. Same here. Um, Bailey defeated Io Sky by pinfall. Singles match yeah. for the women's title. Oh, uh, sweet Bailey. <clears throat> Did you see her uh, exclusive interview? Oh my gosh, and she turned face. Yeah, I love that. Oh my God. And Bailey. What was that? Ain't no stopping her now. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I'd be not going to get a DMCA. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. You're going to make me have a crush on Bailey. Stop it. <laughs> I'm kidding, Deshaun. I'm kidding. I know. I know. We, we, I mean, it's a, well, it's not a word because uh, there's, some, there's some women wrestlers that I do got a crush on, so it's not a work. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And the big one, the main event. Cody Rhodes defeated Roman Reigns with Paul Heyman. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I was, you know what? To be fair, I, I, I'm glad I got that this one right, but I almost nearly had a heart attack because when, as soon as it went, as uh, soon as it went, uh, Bloodline Rose, I knew I was getting worried just a tad bit. And, yeah, but the one thing that got me, oh. Push my brain. I forgot to do the theme music. Wait, let me do the two theme music and then then uh, we'll finish talking about it. Like I love that theme. Oh, 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 Oh my gosh, Cody Rhodes is one of my favorite wrestlers right now on TV. Oh, I knew you was in heaven as soon as you won. I knew you was in heaven. But I was like, oh. I, but, I, but I was glad that the rain ended, cause, you know. I do. But, but much, but yeah. respect to Roman. But much respect to Roman Reigns, so. I think you said. To be fair, uh, we had a conversation last night about uh, one of the press conferences that turned me off, and you said. Which is uh, which has made a lot of sense because uh, even in at, at uh, Hollywood, you know, the actors are not really bad guys. They're just uh, doing the character. So you said, I uh, like the person, but hate the character, and that's something that stick with me all, all through the night. And I just want to want to point that out because I hated the fact that Roman, uh, because you 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 boo a person, and when they first started doing these press conferences, they let the uh, the reporters cheer, and they let the reporters, you know, you know, just be themselves. But when Roman Reigns did, I was like, oh no, he did not do that to the. Lady. And the lady was wearing glasses. I wear glasses, so I was like, I would kind of feel like sticking up for the lady. Yeah, I was like, but... oh, no, you did not do. I said you did not do that to that lady, kicking her out like that just because she booed you. How dare you! Um, but he was like, 
But um, oh, but brother yeah, Will's was... very, yeah, he's, he's very protective of his character. Oh, okay, but because I would have booed him too. I would have booed him too, and then, and if he would kick me, I'd like, you know what? I'm not leaving. Huh? Well, because well, well, he's, protect- well, that's because he's protective of his character. That's why. Yeah, but I did so he bad. Does want, he does not want to break kayfabe. He does not want to break kayfabe. Yeah, I, I mean, I still felt bad for the, the the lady reporter. I hope she knew it was. I hope she knew it was a work. Yeah, it works. <laughs> anyway, anyway, wow. But um, but I but here's my thing: why he didn't defend the title so much? Because um, treatment for you know. Oh wow. <laughs> well, yeah, that 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 was that was wild. I mean. Whew. I mean, if, 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 if this is an indication on how it's going to be when WWE goes to Netflix, I mean, there's no telling where it would go with, all, with these press conferences. But still, in good health, he deserves it. Yeah. Get their flowers. Get their flowers while they can. Yeah, for the rains. <laughs> Good health, and he deserves it. And you know, another, another thing we talked about off air. I explained to you before we even set up to do the uh, the WrestleMania um, uh, post show. I said that okay, so his uh, his condition came back, the leukemia came back. Why? And and forgive me for 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 saying this, y'all. Why in the hell are you going to keep him healed? And you know he has cancer, and especially with, with that whole thing with the reporter, even though it was the work, you you know he has cancer. Why would you make people hate him and he has cancer? Why why would you do that? I was like, that 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 whole thing turned me up because you want you would want to keep him something like that people would love while he's suffering, while he's struggling. They, and they, 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 love, they, they love the man, but they hate the character on TV. Exactly, exactly. And that's why I, mean, I, still, yeah, I still love the uh, the mute his music and then they had a choir did his music for him. That was it was cool. And I like I like this oh wait, 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 wait. Big D country Acknowledge me. <laughs> I liked it that part. Uh anyway. Yeah, but- even, but Reigns is still a great, but um, but do you think this is an indication that the big dog could come back? Oh, yeah, it could be. It could be. I mean, cause, did you see The Undertaker and also John Cena? Came? I mean, they still got it. They still got it. Oh, my God. Holy moly, guacamole. I just, I couldn't believe when I saw the highlights. I couldn't believe that. I mean, even did the whole thing with the lights came uh, came out. Even though he came back as uh almost came back like uh, he did like half the uh, the dead man and half the uh, looked like he was a biker, the uh, the American badass. So he just I don't know I don't know how he did it, but he did it. <laughs> the theatrics, and I love it. Oh my God! Wow that 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 was a that was a that, that was a definite WrestleMania moment. <laughs> Wow! all the same. Oh yeah! Before we do that, uh, I forgot. Did you hear the announcer's emotion when she was announcing Cody Rose? I mean, you could just literally oh feel it. Wow! My oh my God! Now, uh, now, seeing his this generation, Howard Finkel. Oh my God! Man, wow. she, man, Samantha Irvin. She's this generation's. Howard Finkel. Yeah, I think I, I, they need to keep her. I, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't care what anybody else thinks. They need to keep her. Oh my God. I mean, your thoughts, Sean? Think, 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 think she'll be the new Howard? Think, think these, this generation's Howard Finkel? Yeah, I, th- I think so too. I mean, she's up there. She's definitely up there. Definitely. Along with um, she's also this generation's um, Gary Michael Capetta as well. 
Yeah, another favorite one that I have was Lillian Garcia. Oh, and she definitely can throw down. She definitely can throw down those nights every time she sings the Star Spangled Banner. Oh my God. Well, another another announcer I could think of in the next generation was um David Penzer as well. Oh wow. Ooh. I'm definitely making you feel old. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> But soon as soon as when the referee, I had a question for you. When you were watching that match, and 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 then the the whole thing was going down, and then Cody Rhodes was winning, and then when the referee finally hit the one, two, three, how did you feel, man? How did you? And that his theme song was the the one that you picked for me. And then knowing that, how did you feel when that actually happened? Wow. Like, wow, and also put that as one of my personal ringtones as well. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what a night. Now I, now I have to, well, at least if I can't finish the story in, uh, in the family sense, I have to finish the story. And uh, now, I'm, now I'm inspired because I have to finish the story at least in college. Yeah. So now I'm in the lyrics say, yep, and also in the lyrics say, my father that? said when I was younger, Hard times breed better men. Oh, wow. <laughs> the line from the theme song. Which also oh. means, you can, it means you can put anything in your mind, you can do anything you, you can as long as you persevere. Wow. Man, oh, man. Those Ooh. lyrics hit deep. Those lyrics hit deep. I mean, out of all the podcasts that we did, we did together. This is, I mean, out of every podcast from the beginning until now, this has been the deepest podcast that I ever conducted, ever. Wow, unbelievable, unbelievable. Whew. I mean, let because when I saw it on video, I was. I mean, it was night, but because uh, I couldn't, I couldn't, uh, I couldn't yell because the, uh, uh, you know, my roommates was in and stuff like that, but. Inside my heart was doing flips. Yeah. I mean, it was doing flips. And then I said, okay, now I have to finish the story now. Yeah. Yeah, I, I just got inspired. That's so a great song. Oh, my God. I was, I was rocking that after he won. I was rocking that song. <laughs> that, 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 I bet you had that one on your YouTube playlist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> yeah, I have that on my YouTube playlist too, man. Oh my god! I don't know if they can play that song at my homecoming. It, it, it is a well, maybe they should. Maybe they. I mean, I know I'm a, I'm a Christian, but yeah, maybe they still should play that song. Yeah, <laughs> one song. one of the songs. Huh? It's a good song by Downstate. Yeah. <laughs> Oh gosh! Well, uh, we got to talk about the Hall of Fame as, after this uh, podcast went really deep on us. Wow! Yeah, <laughs> yeah the, Hall of Fame, the Hall of Fame. Let's all right. Let's get into the Hall of Fame segment. Yeah. All right. Going to. The... All right. They go to the 2024 Hall of Fame. Going it up. This year's right. inductee. Paul Heyman. <laughs> Man, I like Former manager and commentator for the American Wrestling Association and World Championship Wrestling. He managed The Undertaker, Mark Calloway, as Mean Mark Callis. Wow. Former Amazing. owner of ECW. On-screen general manager for Monday Night Raw. Managed so many great wrestlers. Also managed Arn Anderson, Ravishing Rick Root, Steve Austin, Kurt Angle, RVD. So many great wrestlers. Exactly, and then and then he's also he was also a special counsel, the wise man. Well, I don't know if he'll still be the the tribal chief after after this one, but Roman Reigns. Bull, also, Bull Nakano. Oh, one wow. Time, one, time, one time WWF Women's Champion, 1994 Slammy Award for most devastating wow. recognized. Wow. Uh, in Japan, 
she retired in she retired in <clears throat> she retired in 19, she retired in 1997 oh wow that's recent um hey Deshaun, you ever heard of a wrestler named um thunderbolt patterson thunderbolt patterson was thunderbolt he was was he one of the uh, the stooges of this man, or is it a different Patterson? Thunderbolt Patterson, a fixture in the National Wrestling Alliance. Oh, okay. Yep. To the 1980s. Oh, wow. Man. He also wrestled in WCW, the National Wrestling Alliance, and in territories from the 1960s to the 1980s. I love to his career. Yeah. Leah Mayavia, <gasps> posthumous, posthumous inductee, represented by her grandson, The Rock. Oh, 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 ran, oh, oh. Ran, ran Polynesian Pro Wrestling, a territory of the NWA in, in Hawaii in the mid 1980s. Wow. All right. Group. The U.S. Express, inducted by. Taylor Rotunda and Micah Rotunda. This is when <laughs> it really got me. This is when it really got me. Oh wow! I think I I think I might know why, but I don't I don't want to mention it because it might trick you. Yeah. So I'll leave yeah. that alone. No, go ahead. Yeah, because um, when they were talking about him near the end of the hall, from near the end of the induction, you know, they were talking about their son. Yeah. Wow. Also in the celebrity wing, they inducted Muhammad Ali. Exactly. Oh my God! Now we know why The Rock got his name, the People's Champion, ever back for ever since way back since when he was in the Nation of Domination. And then, and then, did you see the belt that uh, that uh, Muhammad Ali's widow gave him? Oh my wow. word! That was a beautiful belt. Wow. Oh my God! That was the beautiful belt. Oh. inducted. Represented by his widow Yolanda. Wow, and she still looked good. She still looked good. Competing in the War of the Worlds against Antonio Inoki. Wow. <laughs> what and a also I... sister versus wrestler against Gorilla Monsoon. <laughs> ah. Wow. In other words, um, Bobby Heenan. Wait, you. Ah! Thanks for making me feel old. I remember that. <laughs> also called him a mountain, <clears throat> a mountain of uh, misinformation. Fountain of misinformation, my bad. Oh! Da, 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 da. Oh, God! <laughs> or, or in other words, called him a, or call me a, or I'm called a, what is it? This is a travesty of justice. Oh. Oh, that was a good one. <laughs> well, of course, and, well, whenever, whenever I mean, he called a match a travesty of justice. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Wrestling announcers back then, oh, my gosh. They told a story. They actually told a story. I mean, oh, my God. The they emotion. Said, um, it it makes you want to watch. So I like power slam and a beauty. What a slobberaka! Stone cold! Stone cold! Stone cold! Jim Ross. Yep. Or in other words, um, Jerry Lawler. Yep. But whenever he told him, when he told, what did you like? When he told him, like, like when, like when he told him, or whenever he told him. When he told him, Bobby, and like, so like, like, I'm gonna have you knocked out. Exactly. <laughs> oh, well, oh, man. Oh my gosh. Wow. Or like, oh. or like when Monsoon and Jesse the Body Ventura. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think in the task that had uh, had a little bit of commentary, a little bit. I think did he? Yeah. After he retired from from feeding, though, but. That's yeah. a different, a different time. Exactly. Exactly. Oh, my God. This year's WrestleMania was a complete success. I, I believe it. I believe it. 
I know Triple H. I know Triple H is happy. Oh my God, he's on cloud. He's on cloud one trillion. <laughs> All right. Um, wow. so, so much for listening to this episode of the Big D Zone podcast. Whoa, 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 Sheriff. My bad, uh, my bad. Aren't you forgetting about uh, telling about your podcast? That's right. We got the STL Ocarina podcast now on simulcasting on Facebook and on YouTube. Amen to that. Amen to that. <laughs> you need to check it out. He did his own WrestleMania, uh, own WrestleMania special, especially on Facebook Live. And oh, I tell you, wow. I don't. I'm, I'm mostly doing as a mostly do as a side thing with my with my cousin, but I don't upload that. Oh, okay. But still, I mean, <laughs> maybe maybe you should. I mean, you know, you not only do that here, but also maybe you should. Yeah, I might need to create a separate YouTube channel for that though. Oh, 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 oh yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right. <laughs> I was try- I was trying to be a Paul, I was trying to be a Paul Heyman, uh, a wise man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I love wrestling, man. I, 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 mean, I don't care if people say it's safe, but they still get hurt. That's why they, that's why they usually have uh, PSAs that like say, don't try this at home. That's right, buddy. But, Anywho, thank, if you like what, you, like what you're hearing, check, subscribe, hit that subscribe button. That's right. Become a citizen. That's right. Listen to the sheriff. He's the law. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you next now, time. The now you can close out the show. We'll see you next time in the big D-Zone. Peace.